Now that we have everything set to be woven vertically and horizontally, we are going to work with our horizontal three strand twining. That is the Savage pattern. We divided those six wefts into three. So our first three that we set up and are ready to go, we are going to place our hand in the back, our left hand, and our right hand is going to be what's supporting the weaving. We have one, two, and three. These three are going to alternate and um, go under two, behind two warps, and up in front. So this, this one, you can call it one, two, three, or one, two, three, whichever direction that you like to say as you're weaving. For, for me, I'm going to say one, two, three. So one is going to go under two and three. And it's going to go in the back of where the third one's coming out. I'm going to put it between my pointing finger and my middle finger. And it's going to swivel to the back. And it's going to go behind two warps. There's one, two, and it's going to come up front. And if you position your wefts always up, it's going to keep this nice and straight. Pulling down is going to um, and take it off its course. So we want to keep it up. One, two, three. One is going to drop. And it's going to get hugged by the pointing finger and the middle finger. It's going to swivel to the back. Do you see I'm kind of pulling it up before I go behind the two warps? And now it is in the front. So now it becomes the third. So one and one is going to be grabbed, swivel. The one that's trying to catch up with everyone is going to go under. It's going to go behind where the first one or the last one is coming out. It's going to be gripped by the pointing finger and the middle finger. And it's going to swivel. And once I'm in the back, I give it a little tug up. Open from the two warps that we're going behind. And then with my right hand, I'm going to bring it up. So, another way to do it is reposition my hand to get closer to the weaving. The one that is at the beginning is always trying to, the beginning on the, from the left, is always trying to catch up with the one to the right. It goes exactly where the right one is coming out, over two and up. So this one's going to 
jump over. It's actually jumping over one, two, three, four. It's ju jumping over four warps to catch up with the one, this one right here. So here we have this one jumping over four, going to the back and coming out around and out from two warps. So we have this one stationed at one, two, three, four to catch up with this one. This one's stationed at one, two, and we'll catch up with this one that we haven't woven yet. This one right here. We'll be doing this with the yellow, yellow, and then the black. The Savage Three Strand Twine Pattern. Each weft is 30 inches. Five times the width of the weaving, which is six inches. didn't insert any fringe. That's my bird fern in the background. He likes to be talkative in the morning. We are to the end. Here's the side quartz. And so what's going to happen is this one's going to the back. And then this one's going to the back. So we have one in the front and two in the back. just like the beginning one over here. So now these are ready to be woven vertical. So we just did the, the horizontal three strand twining. These two will be traveling down vertical. So we're going to do the yellow, yellow, and black next videos.